Hello everyone, welcome back to Fury Time channel. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. Thanks for supporting me, guys. Former UFC fighter American Matt Brown spoke about the sensational boxing match between British star Tyson Fury and the Cameroonian Francis Ngano, held in late October in Saudi Arabia. It reminded me of the fight between Buster Douglas and Mike Tyson. Incredible upset. Whether Francis won or not is uh, debatable. But the fact that the fight came to a split decision is a hell of an upset. We found out who Mike Tyson is in the fight with Buster Douglas. He wasn't a good fighter, who would pass anyone he encountered. Buster Douglas rebuffed him and fought him like a man. And the same thing happened here. We found out who Tyson Fury is. He is not the boxer. They think he is, Brown said. Former Absolute Happy Boy World Champion Mike Tyson spoke about the performance of Francis Ngannou in a fight against Tyson Fury. Recall that the fight between Fury and Ngannou took place in Radia, Saudi Arabia, on the night of October 29. Their confrontation ended with Tyson's victory by a split decision of the judges. First of all, it's worth to think that it was a team effort, and we can't take anything away from the others. It was the work of a team. We combined our aspirations and hearts and achieved a result that we did not even expect, Tyson quotes. Francis Nagano spoke about the refereeing in the fight against Tyson Fury. I was a lion fighting on a pack of Guianas. I fought with Fury, the judges and the referee who allowed Tyson to deliver a prohibited elbow strike. I watched the replay of that moment dozens of times. But I still don't understand why the score wasn't a take off him. Nganu wrote on social networks. The manager of the WBC World Heavyweight Champion of Britain Tyson Fury, Spencer Brown, gave an interview for the popular YouTube channel about boxing. The functionary doesn't agree with the opinion of the majority of viewers, and they believe that Tyson performed very well in a fight against former UFC champion Francis Ngannou of Cameroon. Spencer also expressed the reasons that could serve as a regular performance of the heavyweight champion in a fight against the novice professional boxing. If you watch the fight, Ngannou was good, wasn't he? People are talking now. Well, Tyson sucked, but I don't agree with that. He was very good. Obviously, Tyson is much better than what he showed. We know that. It was the culmination of various things that probably didn't work out, but there were no excuses. He said it himself. He had a good old school fight. He earned a lot of money for it. He fought in the kingdom and it was very exciting for him. At the time when he couldn't get a duel, where would he get it? He attempted this fight and he is over the moon. We went into the locker room and it was like a morgue. Everyone was upset, desperate. But why? You just won a fight? You got a huge fee? Open the season in Radia? Open the displays on the boxing map? The manager said. After the fight with Tyson Fury, Francis Ngannou spoke about uh, Dana White. After the fight with Tyson Fury, the head of the UFC, Dana White, continues to definitely ignore the boxing match between Francis Ngannou and Tyson Fury, which almost ended in a sensation. And the ex UFC champion would like to hear the opinion of the former boss about his performance. Dana White feels what Dana White feels, the Cameroonian said in an interview. I think you should send him an invitation and ask him about it. I would like to know that too. Dana is Dana. He put a stick in my wheels, but in the most cases what he says doesn't mean anything, like his words about Asia rivals that I need. Tyson Fury is one of them, right? Who knows, maybe he was right. I'm too big for that and I'm proud of it, said Francis Ngannou. Last weekend, Francis Ngannou gave a competitive fight to Tyson Fury, not only going to entire distance with the current world boxing champion, but also knocking him down in the third round. As a result, the judges gave the victory to the Gypsy King by a separate decision. However, in the public in the Radia met this verdict with a judge's feet home. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel.